Hello everyone, my name is Luchara, and this is Eco. Another episode of our Let's Play series. In our last episode, we made a road out to our copper mine. So we have that done now, so we can get copper. Got our coal mine, got our copper mine, and we have our iron mine going under here. So we're going to have to uh, go out and harvest more of each of those, I would say. Probably this episode, iron especially, because we are going to upgrade our smelting. Uh, we have a new screening machine and we have a stamp mill. These are both going to help our uh, smelting process. So we're going to get both of those on the go today. And we're going to set them up down here where we have our smelting set up. So we're going to expand this. We may, I might double up on the machines. I'll see how effective the new ones are. So this is our current smelting setup. It's pretty plain. I assume the new machines are probably going to be larger. So we may have to move some stuff. We may have to move the stockpile. We will see. Uh, there's a couple other little things we probably have to do today. I know our tailing storage, which is down uh, past our iron mine underground there. That's going to need to be expanded. Oh, let's do a meteor update while it's here. 25 days, 7.5 hours. All kinds of time yet. Uh, one other thing, I probably should have been doing this <laughs> for quite some time, but uh, these uh, upgrades, upgrade module things. I'm not at the right machine to show them off. The carpentry machine. Yeah, these basic upgrades, which then turn into like the higher level upgrades. And then you can put them on your machines. Like, look what this does. Decreases resource cost for the work table by 50. Decreases craft time. Like, that's pretty good, right? I should probably have these on the go already. So, those are our three goals for today's video. Smelting tailing storage, upgrade modules. I will be back shortly with the first of those. So I got an extra stockpile down here for tailings all ready to go, which is good because this one is almost full. And as soon as I start uh, smelting again, it will be full. So let's uh, get stuck apparently. So let's take this up and uh, let's mine some iron on our way back up. I'm just gonna show you my iron patch. It's been a while. It's kind of funny how it looks now because as you come up or come down as the case may be it kind of looks like it's it's done it's gone You're like oh there's one there and oh 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 there's lots okay never mind false alarm all kinds of iron still if i push this in i think there's still some here for a few at least yeah and then it turns to sandstone but I'm pretty sure it just follows the contours of the beach. So we'll be fine. I just thought it was funny the way it looked when he came in. I know I came down the stairs one time and I started panicking. Because <laughs> I was like, oh no, is my iron deposit gone? And why did I leave the cart way over here? Let's move the cart in a little closer. I should probably come in and fill in some of these gaps too. Is there any more down here? Just the one. Oh, there is another one there. Yeah, we'll get that later. My stock? Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So I will be back with the new smelting setup soon. All right. So we have our stamp mill and our screening machine. So let's uh, let's pick up the old machines here that we won't be using anymore. Uh, so that should fit. It's about the same size as the old one, I guess. So we'll get started on this. We will crush our iron. No, I guess we got to link our storages first. Yeah, so we want crush to be at the top because that's where we want it to output. Perfect. So how much can we do here? Quite a bit. Four and a half minutes, that's not too bad. Alright, so let's get our other machine down. Oh, this is... <laughs> this is bigger. This is quite a bit bigger. Oh my god, that's a big machine compared to the, what the other one was. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> all right. Had to take the fuel out first. Will it fit here without that there? Nope. There's. Right, so let's just put it there for now. Let's put you back here. Hmm. Where can that go? I might have to. How much power does this use? 200 and I have 200. Does this use power? I assume it does look at it. 
also needs 200. So we're going to need another, uh, another whatchamacallit. So it does make tailings still. Okay. So we'll need another windmill. So I'm going to build another windmill. I'm going to, I guess I'm going to have to move this stockpile probably over here. I'll have to clear up some dirt and whatnot, but that's fine. All right. So I'm going to do that. I shall be back shortly. All right. Well, found out you can set up windmills like this. So this, I believe works. They're both turning anyway. So let's see if the available power is 400. It is perfect. So now I can operate both of these machines at the same time. So let's uh, put this on. And which one of these is output? This one is supposed to be output. So let's put that at the top. And let's make as much of this concentrated as we can. Actually, we got quite a bit. Yeah, that's a lot. 24. Nice. Oh, that's a lot of a lot of calories burned there. I'm, su I'm actually kind of surprised and happy that these machines uh, don't require <laughs> smelting too, or advanced smelting. So I guess that will be later on. I, I don't know. I don't know what would need that then. But that's good. So I'm not even sure what I'm going to do for my next point. Maybe advanced cooking or baking. Or... Uh, I'm assuming industry would be next here. Paper milling, composites. I, actually, I think I read paper milling is pretty much useless, so I don't think it'll be that. Advanced mace. Oh, glass working, maybe. Yeah, we got a few options for our next point. Not any of these. Well, maybe milling, but I'm going to try to avoid. I don't think I'll need farming or fertilizers. So, yeah. So, all right. So, we're going to let this cook and then. Can we get through here? No. And we can get through this way. And then we'll use this to make some iron. And everything will be right with the world. I'm going to go check on my upgrade modules now. Alright, so I'm finally officially sick of looking at this ugly entranceway to my basement storage. So we're going to fix it. I'm going to clear out this ugliness. I'm going to maybe even clear out these walls, put something cool here. And I might make a staircase, just a, a man size, not cart size staircase, going up into the, the base itself. Maybe where would I want it to come out? Where would it be convenient to come out? <laughs> Can't even get in here. Get in over here. All right. Good stuff. Where could I get it to come out? Right here. Just pop up in the floor right here. Might be good. Yeah, maybe we'll do that. I'm going to start work on this though now. And I will be back with an update shortly. Alright, well we cleared out a bunch of the crap here. I, I mean, obviously, it still needs work. I'm going to... I don't know if I want to put put some brick here and here maybe. Or maybe some of these stone road pieces. Like, would, this, would those look good stacked up on the side like that? I wonder. I don't know. I'll mess around with stuff. So, I mean, I don't know. It looks better even just like this, even though it's all, <laughs> you know. But, yeah, it's just less claustrophobic, I guess. All right, so I still need to build my little uh, stairway to heaven here. So let's get started on that. And so, yeah, so we're just... I just want to be able to quickly get up into the base if I need to, right? Because I can't right now. i got to go... Well, I can go up like this and jump on all this crap. It'd just be nice to have a stairway, right? So we're going to go this way, I think, with the stairs up into the kitchen. And then if we need to get into the workshop, it's really... i leave that there, actually. It wouldn't be too bad. All right, so I'm going to finish this up, and I will be back shortly. All right, so I have my stairs up to the kitchen completed. Ooh, and here we are, we're right in the kitchen. Get into the workshop right quick. Way easier, more convenient. Looks better. I mean, obviously, <laughs> this looks pretty sad, but... Ooh, crushed iron. Grab all the crushed iron I can get. Not playing around with that. Nice. Alright, bonus. I'll take it. 
So that looks good, I think. I'm just... Mm. How would brick look lining the sides of this? Probably just want to go with blocks, right? Let's just see how it would look. How's... I don't know. Does this look good? Let me just put a couple more up here. and That way we can see. See how it looks. Ah, I mean, it looks kind of cool, but we got so much brick up there. I feel like it'd be better to have something different down here. So I think I'm going to try with the road pieces. I'm going to pick up this brick, and I'll come back with the road pieces, and we'll see how that looks. So... I came out to my kitchen to uh, to make some food, and I saw the red light. When I click status, it is no longer contained within a room. I I assume it's because of this. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, it was a fun experiment, but a failure. So, yeah. So we're going to have to figure out some other way to get stairs coming up here, I guess. Let's see if this fixes it. Yep. All right, well. Now we know. <laughs> Alright, let's make some meat stock here. And then we'll uh, continue to uh, go on with our lives, I guess. It's really all we can do. All that work for nothing, though. It's always... That's unfortunate. Oh, well. I'll survive. Alright, so I placed some of the stone roads here in the sides. I don't know if I like it, though. Honestly. I mean, I don't hate it. I don't know. What does anybody else think? Should I maybe try some mortared stone instead? I'm just going to leave what I have up. I'm not going to finish it, though. And just... What, 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 what would other people like to see me try to finish this up? To finish these, this little tunnel into my basement? I'm willing to listen. Because I'm not particularly uh, good with this part of the game. The making stuff look good part. So if anybody has any ideas, I am all ears. Alright, so these upgrade modules. I made them a bunch of the basic upgrade ones. And then the basic upgrade two, I think I gotta come over to here. And then, then it's uh, up here. Yeah, so we need, we have ten. We need mortar stone, so we're making a bunch of mortar stone right now. And then we're gonna make ten more of these. Of the upgrade twos. And you gotta come back to the carpentry table to make the upgrade threes. And that needs wood boards and plant fibers. So we're gonna have to go harvest a bunch of plant fibers. So we're gonna queue up a bunch of boards before we go. Uh, so it wants 10, so we're gonna need 100. We have, what's that, 38? So let's just do, we'll say 80. Sure. That works for me. That goes in there. I think boards, yeah, boards go in storage chests. Beautiful. And now we are going to go get a bunch of plant fibers, which I mean, I think you can pretty much just cut down anything, right? No, that did not get plant fibers. Okay, yeah, it did. That did. Yeah. All right, so I'm just going to go on a... Ah! What are you doing? It scared me. Go on a, a plant murdering mission here, and I will be back with a bunch of plant fibers soon. So I got enough plant fibers that I can make... Uh, can make all these basic upgrades. I have the boards, I have the fibers, because it uses 38 per. I'm making 10. It's just busy making some hewn logs right now. But we'll queue this up. And then I was looking at the basic upgrade 4, which is over here. Where's it at? Needs the threes. It needs even more plant fibers, 67 a per. So I'm going to have to go harvest a whole bunch more plant fibers. And it also needs. Uh, wooden wheels which aren't a big deal uses hewn logs which is why I'm doing that hewn log project over there and it's good because it gets rid of all this wood I have I have a lot of wood hanging around um, so yeah these basic upgrade fours they're pretty good reduces the cost and the craft time by 45 percent and they can be uh, specialized so the basic engineering upgrade for example it's 50% at this table, so that's good. But then I realized, too, that there's also the advanced upgrades, which I think start over here. 
So the advanced upgrade one just uses brick and clay, which is fine. Actually, that's good because it gets rid of my, my brick that I have around. Um, but then the advanced upgrade two is also here, but it needs glass working. It needs glass and it needs sand. So that makes me lean towards... I'm just going to make the basics for now. I'm not going to lose any sleep over the advanced, but that leads me towards taking glass working for my next skill. I do have a skill point. And there's glass working there. I'm um, just wondering, anybody who's a little more experienced than me or anybody knows, is glass working a logical next skill point for me? Is there something else that I, you know, am I going to regret it? I mean, I guess it is only... Yeah, it's only seven hours till my next skill point anyway, so I'll probably just take glass working. But if anybody knows, just let me know in the comments. Yeah, because, man, my, my XP modifier is up over 500 now. This good food is is good, obviously. Look at that, even higher now. Every little bit helps, right? All right, so I'm going to go harvest a bunch more plant fibers for these basic upgrade fours. Maybe I'll go a little further out from base for this this time, but... Yeah, I'll be back after I get like 400 more plant fibers. So I actually came down, down over whatever to the uh, rainforest slash jungle, whatever you want to call it for this. Uh, these plants here, they're pretty common and they drop five fibers. And then there's these ones drop three. And then there's another one. See the, how many of these there are. And there's also, there's these ones drop five. I think these ones drop five. Right, so I, I don't know, it's going pretty quick here. Plus, there's also um, where, oh, there's right here these. You don't even have to use the sickle. You can just pick them up. There are only three, though. But, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm getting close to 400 there already. 317 right now. Yeah, so I'll be done here shortly. And we'll head back to base and uh, make some more upgrades. Upgrade modules or whatever you want to call them. Look at all these. Just sitting there. Just asking for it. All right, we'll be back shortly. All right, we are back at base, so we're gonna. We need ten wooden wheels, so we're gonna queue those up, and we need ten of the basic upgrade threes, of course. So we'll queue those up. Oh, how come there's only nine of these? Didn't we do ten? Well, I'll do nine for now, and then I'll see if I can figure out what happened to the tenth one. Did it go in a different storage, maybe? That's odd. Where are they? Where are those ten at? Or the nine, I guess. They're there. Okay, so there's they're there. There's space for more. Did I only make nine? No. I, I apparently lost one somewhere along the way. That is weird. Alright, well, it is what it is. Not going to make another one now. Anyway, so those are queued up. They're going to take uh, quite some time, though. So I will be back when those are completed. All right. So we are ready to make some basic upgrade fours. I see there is 10 of them now, so I guess when I thought there was one missing, it was just in the process of being crafted. Like, the the first one had been consumed as uh, as fuel or whatever, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Anyway, so this is going to be 20 minutes. So we will queue that up. And then I think that's probably going to be all for this video. So in the next one, we're probably going to learn glass working. Unless anybody has a better idea, I am uh, willing to hear suggestions. And if anybody has a suggestion for what to do down here, I'm also willing to listen. I guess I could just try the different types of mortar stone and see which one looks the best, right? But, I don't know. Anyway, so I gotta build some stairs maybe on the outside here. <laughs> Since my inner stairs did not work. Oh well. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Be good to each other. And I'll see you in the next one.